Mabrika! Welcome to a new episode of Let's Talk Taino. I'm Priscilla Colon, co founder and creative here at Casa Reito, where our mission is to promote the Taino language and culture. Before we begin, I'd love for you to take a moment to subscribe to our channel and click those notifications. It will help us reach more viewers just like you who want to learn about the Taino language and culture. On today's episode, I have a fun game for us to play that'll help us practice our Taino. It's called Connections. And I have to thank my son because he's the one who told me about this game that he plays. I think there's a New York Times or a website that has this available every day. So, this is how the game works. We're going to take a look at a series of pictures, and I want you to be a detective. You'll have to think about how these things are connected. How are they the same? How are they different? And in some cases, I'll have some hints available so you can figure out the answer. So, I'll tell you how this will work for us. I'm going to show you a series of pictures and their Taino words. Not with their English translations, but I think you can guess what these are. The pictures are pretty obvious. Then you'll have to figure out what all of these things have in common. How are they connected? So let's do the first example. I'm pretty sure you'll get to figure it out quickly. So, how are these things connected? Yuka, Ababaya, Mangoliren, Arepa. Guayaba, arroz. What is the connection? Of course, they are ima, food. See, that was super easy. Now let's take a look at our next series of objects. How are these things connected? Trenígena, carógena. Bisihena, tasihena, kamiohena, motorahena. How are they connected? They are all ihenakano, transportation. That one was super obvious, even if you didn't see our previous episode on transportation. Now let's take a look at the next one. This will be a slightly bit more difficult, and there's a hint. How are these things connected? Let's take a look. Boriken, Yamayeka, Haiti, Hawaii, Kubanakan. Now there might be a couple of different answers here. So, I've given you a hint. They're surrounded by water. So, what's the connection? They are Kaikunagu Islands, of course. Now, not all of the examples of Kaikunagu Islands were actually Taino homelands. There was one, Hawaii. That is not a Taino homeland, but I wanted to bring this up because the word Hawaii has an interesting origin. The word may actually mean homeland, underworld, or ancestral home. And this word, Hawaii, comes from the Proto Polynesian Savaiki. In Maori, it is Hawaiki. In Rarotongan, it's Apvaiki. And in Samoan, it's Savai. Now, why is Hawaii so similar in all of these languages? Well, because they are all related languages. They're all Polynesian languages. Isn't that cool? They have the same thing happen in their languages as happens in our languages. So, when we're studying Taino and we see that a word may be slightly different from island to island, this naturally happens in languages. It happens in all of these other Polynesian languages too. Wasn't that a great lesson? We used a simple game of connections to practice our Taino vocabulary and see how the items, objects, islands, and so much more are related or connected. Now, before we leave, let's review one more time everything we learned today. You'll notice that many of the words are actually originally from the Taino homeland or from indigenous America. Ima, 
food. Yuka, yuka. Ababaya, papaya. Mangoliren, mango. Arepa, arepa. Guayaba, guava. Arroz, rice. Ihenakano, transportation. Trenígena, train. Carógena, car. Bicígena, bicycle. Tacígena, taxi. Camiógena, truck. Motorágena, motorcycle. Kaiku, island. Kaiku Nagu, islands. Boriquen, Puerto Rico. Yamayeca, Jamaica. Haiti, Haiti. Hawaii, Hawaii. Cubanacan, Cuba. Thank you as always for joining me here week after week to learn Taino with me. That was a fun connections game. And next week, we're going to continue making more connections. If you want to learn more and continue learning on your own, you can check out our resources at casarito.com. You'll find children's books, other book recommendations, and our digital course where you can learn Taino words, phrases, and practice in full conversations. I recommend that you also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter to stay in the know. In the meantime, Taikaraya Guaitiao Nagu.